So we return to Ingersoll Lockwood, where previously the countdown was correct at 14 days, but now it's 16 days again. Anomaly19 posted this screen cap set. I will talk about it. So I think this reality has started to become pretty strange. And I think the reason has to do with collective consciousness. Yesterday I've been receiving some 777 signals. And I think this relates to Seven's connection to the collective consciousness. 777 is a highly spiritual number with mystical number seven appearing tripled, making its influence most powerful. Number seven resonates with the collective consciousness, spiritual awakening and awareness, spiritual enlightenment, spiritual acceptance and development, intuition, inner knowing, inner wisdom, empathetic abilities, psychic abilities, the esoteric, the inner self, deep contemplation and introspection eccentric religion, thoughtfulness, understanding others, natural healer and healing, secrets, myth, ritual, peace, poise, emotions and feelings, inner strength, endurance and perseverance, persistence of purpose, the ability to bear hardships, solitary and isolation, long sighted, the nonconformist, independence, individualism, intentions, manifesting and manifestation, and time and space, good fortune, mental analysis, philosophy, the philosophical, technically, scientific research, science, alchemy, genius, a keen mind, specializing, and a specialist, determination, logic, understanding, discernment, and discerning, knowledge seeking, study, education, and learning, evolution, stability, ability to set limits, contemplation, refinement, stoicism, silence, perfection, chastity, dignity, rigor, and ahead of times. Due primarily to selfless communication and love, these qualities are starting to manifest more and more in the general population. Now let's take a look at Anomaly 19's post. So I brought up IngersollLockwood.com forward slash tides hyphen turning forward slash. I wasn't able to navigate to this web page through the website. I'm sure someone knows how to do that. But I wanted to show you something interesting that Anomaly pointed out. So when you highlight this phrase, you get this additional statement highlighted to become visible. It says Keystone dates 9-11-2021, avoid FFs, and then 9-17-2021, something big, that's the point of the countdown. Then you have 9-18-2021, more FFs, and then 11-19-2021, evil. So I think it's a good idea for us to meditate on those 777 qualities, especially for this given time period of 9-11 through 9-17. The more you grow yourself in these qualities, the more you promote the 100th monkey effect. Read about the Koshima monkeys to learn more about what this means. Remember, as I told you before with Stephen G. Samuel's previous message to myself, don't count on us or trust the plan or even POTUS 45 or anyone but our creator. In the end, for the Patriots wish for this timeline to turn out to be a success. It all depends on us manifesting the 777 qualities and not depending on the work of others. Reviewing more of this page with you, we have a video which I won't play now, This is, which is from Mary Poppins' movie. There's this statement, history repeats itself. 40 years in a desert. Why? In Dune, who are the freemen? free men and free women. Who are you? Why are you here? The great reset is the eye of the needle. The great awakening is us going through it. Fear and coming out the other side. Love. Here's a clip from Dune. Fear is the mind killer. As this is a fan made trailer, I'll play a bit of it for you. Fear is the mind killer. Fear is the little death that brings total obliteration. I will face my fear. And I will permit it to pass over me. Where the fear is gone, there will be nothing. Only I will remain. Hmm, solar eclipse symbology. As many as 124 million Democrats have taken the RNA, you know what's, that are linked to infra auto. D's and increasing D's. The left. Take me back to Egypt, to slavery. 
I would rather be a slave with suffering. I am used to that than risking dying here in a desert. That's two times the number of registered Republicans who have allegedly taken the RNAVs. Meanwhile, a majority of 70 million gun page Americans have not taken the RNAVs. The righteous 40 years have passed. We are the next generation. We shall conquer the remaining giants, the great grandchildren of the Nephilim, the fallen angels who follow loose. We are desert hardened. We are free men. If we draw the line and hold our ground, there are more of us, much more than them. No call for violence. However, the clock is running out. We are nearing Lock 2.0. Fight the D variant narrative. Do not allow for Lock 2.0. Deagle.com experts predicted less than 80 million American population in three years, then scrubbed their published research. Can you find it? Yes, I found it, and I have been sitting on this page for a few weeks. I had planned on making a video covering the topic of the predictions by this particular website, but I just didn't know how to create a video that would be safe for the monopolistic tech platforms. I will pin the link to this. To the comments. So some of the interesting patterns you see in this data is India's population is predicted to increase from 1.2 billion to 1.3 billion. As we know, they are heavily using the medicine Ivermet. Can't say the full name, but I'm sure you know Ivermet what I'm talking about. As you see in infections per 100,000 inhabitants, this data is from worlddata.info. India is doing pretty well, 3.0 compared to the rest of the world. In contrast, looking at Israel, they're at 91.6 per 100,000 inhabitants, which is some of the highest in the world. Do you understand the pattern? Reconciling what we know about the poke rates in these different countries versus ivermectin use in these different countries. We see that the United States has the highest infection rate at 192,000. However, we know that evidence of dishonesty in the way data is presented is perhaps most obvious here compared to all the other countries. So per Deagle's website, the United States has a massive population drop from 326 million down to 99 million, which is pretty much two thirds of the population gone. Like the United States in Israel, only 35% of its population is expected to remain in this prediction, a decrease from 7.8 million down to 2.8 million and you know they are heavily heavily taking the v and in case you're wondering this is the population forecast for 2025 i was aware of bill deagle back in 2006 2007 and i had a lot of skepticism for some of his doom and gloom predictions he made even at that time but i have to say this information that he presented here is pretty interesting it was so interesting he had to take down the website so back to Stephen G. Samuel's discussion. Deagle.com experts predicted less than 80 million population in three years. Well, I have to say, we just saw the result, it was 90 million, so it might be a bit of an inaccuracy. He noted they scrubbed their published research. Can you find it? Do you not smell what the Democrats are cooking? It's like a rock reference there. Is the upcoming booster a KS? bodies programmed to reproduce certain proteins which is dehived one rom what exactly guess who had the 70 percent increase in revenues for clot medicine this year yeah it was pfizer with prayers peace love prosperity safety and freedom fellow freeman sgs and then he gives this call for special additional bonus homework where you can try to publicize issues relating to the reporting of the D variant. Of course, there are many ways we can choose to be activists in this situation. Remember, now is the supercritical period. It's a good time to develop these qualities, endurance, perseverance, persistence of purpose, ability to bear hardships, solitary, isolation, long-sighted, non-conformist independence and individualism spiritual acceptance and development intuition inner knowing rigor 
ahead of the times. Till next time. Have you ever wondered why smart, educated people are falling for the narrative? It's because this divide is revealing the level of consciousness people are at. What is considered smart and educated in our world does not necessarily reflect the level of consciousness someone is at. This is revealing who is driven by fear and who is driven by expansion and love. I just want to remind you all that one is not better than the other. Both are valid explorations of different frequencies. But I still think it's incredibly fascinating how obvious it is now to tell what level of consciousness someone is operating at now. It wasn't so visible before.